Welcome back, everyone, to Let's Play Victory at Sea Pacific, episode number 37, I think. We had a very interesting episode last last video. Uh, lots of little bugs. Um, what can I say about it other than, gosh, I wish I could just write a bug report. In my head, you know, the way I kind of think about it is, uh, well, let me just send them a link. <laughs> Don't make me do all the hard work, or give me a send bug report button somewhere on the... If this was early access, we would definitely tolerate like a send bug report button down on the bottom right or something, but... Anyway, I'm pretty sure that they are not watching these videos, so I really need to... make the effort. So, what do we have going on? Um, we have the destruction of the battlecruiser fleet, it has given us a lot of war bonds. And we have the destruction of, well, basically the another battlecruiser fleet is giving us a lot of war bonds up here. We still have these destroyers just slowly meeting their end over here in midway. Uh, interesting that we are now starting the battle. What? Interesting. Oh, there's another bug. Not really, though. This one's not that bad since it didn't teleport them into our base. But they are very close to... What? So I... Huh. Just launch somebody over here so that we very quickly can get eyes on. In fact, that's probably what Midway herself should do. Just launch somebody so we can get eyes on. Queuing up. Ready. Launch. Launch. Oh, there it is. They're catapulted into the sky. I quite like that. <laughs> Very convenient to start from, you know, 6,000 feet up. Yeah, these guys are having a real issue, aren't they? I think I heard our shots going off. There they are. Grappling through the air. We are up oh, there. Oh, that's a lot of shells. No hits yet. Seems to be turning. Oh, we got hit. Let's route to the other one. Hey, we'll see what happens with that. There goes the first one. One more down. 660 is our current amount. I could, if I, if I were you, I would just very simply wind the video five seconds to figure out how many points that garnered me. We're at 661 now. Whoa! I thought the first one. Wait, wait a second. Not a terrible bomb drop, maybe? Well, it'll be off. It's going to scare him, though. Ooh, not off by much. Oh, that looked good. Surrender. Hoist your white flag. Do not go gently into that good night. It's not going to be a very gentle going. Well, um, where are they? these coming from? Oh, we have another flight. Oh, um, wow. Okay, it's over! 673. So I think that was like, what, 12 war bonds? Maybe 11? I'd guess it'd have to be. Oh, I mean, I guess it's 10 to 12. Some kind of value like that. Anyway, so these guys will return to base. You will return to repair all your things. And now we can concentrate our attention only on Truck Lagoon for the time being. And I think there is a way for us to still 
get first sag involved in truck lagoon without dying to, to their coastal guns we're gonna attempt to do that in the meantime i'm gonna send ctf bravo south we did see that fleet moving um from truck down to south i don't know where they're going for all i know they're hunting task force 22 well good luck task force 22 is unsinkable i say famous last words of course but let's i want to in my head i between after the last episode i was thinking let's try, just try to advance time a little bit faster uh one because i kind of want to get out of this campaign i think some of the bugs that we're facing i'm just this is a guess that maybe there's something corrupt with this game file if they've never seen this um, transporting kingfisher bug before, I have to think it's something related to... Well, the tutorial I had a very bad time with, right? We had a lot of bugs even in that. Here we are, some 35 episodes later, persisting, because the game shows that much promise. But I have given some thought to ending this series early. Like, maybe if we take Truck, Marianas... Maybe if we take the eastern side of New Guinea, we just end it there. Or we go drop the bomb. I don't know. But I am considering ending early. Mind you, <laughs> Rule the Waves 2 is coming out, and that is... Oh. Did they just shoot down my airplane? I don't know what they were doing. Probably. I mean, Task Force 22 is actually pretty close to... <laughs> what, what are you trying to do, Task Force 22? We gotta... What's your mission out here? Is it to take the ports? Because they will probably suffer from... I think we're going to have to take these two first. I'm just guessing that if we try to invade, the amphibious fleets will suffer a lot from um, air. Air raids. Although, maybe not. What's the range? Let's actually just launch one aircraft. If we can. And we can. Oh, their range is... Uh, not quite yet. And we do have two airplanes. Do they know? Are they in the know? We do expect some fleet to be down here somewhere. We should be able to rearm, refit, whatever at Port Moresby if we need as well. <laughs> yeah, we have a lot of scouts missing because of so, low fuel, out of fuel. Ah, does that mean that these guys have finally... Oh, this is interesting. Does that mean that they're finally out of fuel? This could explain, by the way... Aviation fuel is, like, infinite. Whoops. Aviation fuel on the Pensacola is none. Okay, well, that does not explain why our other aircraft were... By the way, why can't they just share fuel? Eh, just huck a few barrels of fuel on over. I suppose it doesn't work that way. <sighs> but at least our, our fine fleet up here is able to make it a little bit closer to now to Attic. Alright, so what do we... I mean, we're still cruising along at 100... No, we're not right now because it's paused. Good. Well, I mean, look, we can solve this another way. We just send out fighters. Somewhere over here, there were <laughs> cruisers. I think that we're in happy face mode right now. Dennis is trying to insist that these airplanes don't launch fueled unless you're if you're in happy face mode, but I mean, we clearly see that that isn't the case. <laughs> they, happy face mode doesn't mean they can't fly. It just means that... I mean, I don't... I frankly don't know what exactly it means. It means that it goes down to the settings that we see here. But for whatever reason, happy face mode just decreases flight crews. It doesn't completely disable them. And I guess that they won't be ready to launch unless they're refueled anyway. Let's actually take a look at what happened to Pensacola. So it says low fuel on it. Have we ever seen this low fuel warning before um, when we're trying to take off those airplanes? No. We can go back to the last episode and check. Anyway, I don't want to, you know, I'm, I think that in the end he's trying to be helpful, but. Uh, 
Hmm, don't see them. Did have a little bit of a mist area over here. I think we will just move all the way over, scout Samalawo. Maybe send one aircraft, which can scout both. And we'll, I think we're just gonna gun it. Get the raid points. Worst case scenario, um, I mean, sorry, uh, worst case scenario, we send an amphibious launch and we fit and it fails, but best case, hey, we actually take it over and begin weakening their hold on New Guinea. And I know what I wanted to go to the Mariana Islands first, but first things first, and the first thing is Truck Lagoon. So yeah, I guess we aren't going to do an amphibious invasion yet. We can do the damage, but we won't. We probably don't even want to really go over here since I don't want to be too distracted if something comes up while we're in the middle of an engagement over here. So I'm just going to send them south. Because <laughs> at this point, the carrier should come back north. And we're going to. I don't know how far we need, or how close we need to get to be in guns range of Truck Lagoon. Probably a ways still. But I don't even know if we can do this attack at all. That is... I mean, what we need to do for that is actually launch our dive bombers. And what I'm going to do, I'm still going to try to pull this off. Try. We'll see. Yeah, I see. These fighters are just hunting my spotters. Whoa, 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 whoa. Go to combat mode. Does that mean that they're all in combat mode? Yeah, so you put them all into combat mode. They're all completely manned. So, again, this comment... I don't know. Anyway, uh, so what I want to say is... When we go to the combat mode in this bottom, everyone is triggered. Everyone is to battle stations, as you'd expect. So, we don't need to worry about... Uh, whether or not they're going to be firing their AA or not. They should just be firing it. Unfortunately, they don't, but they should. I really, really strongly think that they should. Okay, get up there. Anybody who doesn't who survives, I mean, basically. Oh, we have to watch out for them launching with no fuel as well, I guess. Alright, good. The aircraft, the anti aircraft is working. Hooray! Yeah. Oh, well, that's a lot better. Okay, well. What do we do with these? Well, we know. Uh, kind of the good news is, we know that there's no. Ah, well. We see that there's something, some valves. Good, we have something for our our boys to do. We'll, do. we'll get this flight as well out just to as a reception party, but they won't be the group who actually does anything. I wonder if um, airplanes crashing into boats, ships, is modeled. Does it do damage? I also wonder... Do the aircraft increase or decrease based on how many aircraft you have left? Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And what does Yorktown have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It does. It, it actually exactly models. And how many aircraft? One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. So they have five. I guess this is supposed to be five. So it, even though they're up in the air, I guess it still counts them. It just shows you how many they have. That's pretty cool. And our Enterprise, let's just make a guess. They have no dive bombers. Well, one dive bomber in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. It's impossible. Yeah, it's not quite right. So. 
something that is a little off. Maybe it's just a random assortment. I don't know. Um, are we chasing ghosts here? We might be chasing ghosts. But, all right, well, let's speed up again. They're just going back to land. That's fine. Uh, we're off battle station, so we're back. Yep. Happy face mode. Okay, good. Well, good. And honestly, the thing we should be worrying about most, I, if, if I were them, I would be, well, I guess I would be going after the, uh, speak of the devil, the carriers with my any bombers. Are these the the there they there they are should have should have flown our cap after all not a big deal okay let's go to fleet I'm gonna do it this way because it worked last time yeah looks like it's working all right let's see if this works and we're kind of heading north already the good news is we can launch these aircraft immediately and see how effective it is. I want to get these kates. I'm going to send the second one after these kates. I'm just going to move them that way so that it doesn't bug out and like you get your own division just to fly that way. So will we shoot at these aircraft as they approach? Let's find out. Should be circling up. Good, we are. So far, no anti aircraft. Is it against dive bombers that we're incapable of launching? Or shooting at anti aircraft? I mean, they're the same. Why are you not? You're doing the same thing. It's the same old, same old. Okay, well, let's make sure that we have our guys very appropriately aligned. So one here, one here, and we need somebody on the top left. Still think I don't know why. Why are they not shooting? It's incredible. I will. Uh, it's the same old story as last time. Like, do we? If this gets through because of the stupidity of all. Oh, never mind. Suddenly the AA began. So maybe they were just over the ceiling of it. All right, let's really pursue this. I mean, I'm willing to pursue this all the way back to make sure we don't get. Surprised again. I won't get pulled again. That was my rendition of. <laughs> uh, holy cow! <laughs> Rolling Stones. I don't even know the song. <laughs> well, whatever song it's supposed to be. Forget it. Let's pretend this never happened. Okay, well, anyway, um, what else do we need to worry about? At least I'm happy those aircraft are gonna go that way. This guy, let's just send them all the way over. If we happen to see those aircraft, those Kates or whatever, the Emilys, whatever they are coming in, great. If not, that's also just fine. If we don't have to worry about them, that's great news. Alright, gonna send. Oh, just when I was sending them home. Three torpedo bombers. Okay, you guys, I don't think we need all these people. What in God's name are you doing? You don't have any ammunition. You do. Go intercept. You do. Go intercept. You have ammunition. 
one of these didn't get clicked, I don't even know who it was, but, and you, who don't have am no, you do, wait, you guys all have ammunition, what, huh, alright, well, let's see what happens here, I don't think one of these guys got picked up. Oh, you don't, so just drop your... I don't even care about dropping bombs, but... I think we got him. <laughs> it's like, run! Run! Uh... Oh my god, I thought this guy was just gonna... What are you doing? No, this guy. What are you doing? What the hell? Well, if I go away into the strategic screen, maybe it just won't matter. Almost time to get our bombers up. I think it's almost time. So we survived Truck Lagoon's repaired um, new wave of bombers. Uh, Midway, these guys are joining there. These, this Omaha is supposed to join. Wait, Midway. Ah, they're gonna join this fleet, which <gasps> has Hell Divers and Hellcats ready to go, and Hell Diver Hellcats ready to go. Fantastic. So the you know running at high, such high speed has its has the benefits. I think I will wait momentarily. Let's just dock. I will wait momentarily for this to be absorbed so that it can get fuel. CTF able. Yep, they finished. Fantastic. And that we need the same treatment for CTF Bravo now with all these casualties we've taken. Anywho. What are you doing? Is this a spotter? Just get this guy to land. I don't think he knows what he's doing. He knows not what he does. All right. And back up to 25x or so. Yeah, I think we will just go ahead and steal Port Moresby supplies. <laughs> oh, why don't you guys go land? You big dummies. Hmm. Well, things look pretty good. I would say that overall things look pretty good. We're making progress. If we can take Truck Lagoon, that's that's great. Again, what are you guys doing? Not exactly clear here. Okay, uh, and you're still happy face? Yeah. You guys are happy face? Yep. Yeah. Okay, well, the only thing we have to worry about is the sudden appearance of a battleship fleet somewhere, or I guess it would be... I'm not sure if it's better or worse if it's a carrier task force. Okay, let's do this, and then that. This battle, by the way, has been going on since the beginning of time. <sighs> that is still a long way. I feel like we're still a little bit early before we begin dive bombing. But, I mean, the downside is we may not... Okay, Task Force 36. Oh, good. We'll pause. This is, I guess, important enough to get her going. So you merge into one fleet. Fantastic. And that means that you can get going. All right. We have our other group going as quickly as they can up to Commodorsky to retake that. We are in good shape. I'm feeling good. Oh, that was weird. Are these all just spotters? They go to like the somewhere to die. That was weird. What time? What time in the video is this? 
2450 or so. I might use this as my bug report for the teleporting spotters. And then I guess if we open up the first sag, it should show us these kingfishers in the water, just like that. Perfect. That's exactly what I was expecting. So you will just not return. You just, I don't know what's going on. They teleport everywhere with you. So we go over here, they should now appear. There it is. It's reproducible, that's for sure. There it is. <laughs> Come home. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on, but anyway. Uh, let's go ahead and start our dive bombing mission. This is may end poorly. Very may went may very well end very poorly. We just took every bomber and we're launching them. Is that a little premature? No. We actually have a lot of bombers left. So launch them all. The I guess the the goal here is if one or more dies, hopefully still enough of them live. And I think I'm going to do this in kind of like two sets. The lead are going to do dive bombing missions, but the ones just behind them are going to be my manual level bombing missions. The only goal we have is to eliminate the 15 inch guns, and I don't know how many there are. I can't remember if there was four or five maybe. 760 war bonds though, so we're doing well on that front, Jeez. Is it time to upgrade these? I mean, there's still 50 days. It's just a penny today is worth more than a penny tomorrow. So let's save that money for now. These guys are. That's all set. Puget Sound. This one's all set. Yeah, we won't be doing our constructions at Pearl Harbor. It just would take too long. We definitely have the wherewithal to build some more stuff here. I haven't been super impressed with submarines, mainly because of the AI. These Baltimores are really nice though, I mean just incredible in terms of... By the way, what, what kind of guns do they have? Nine eight-inch guns. I say let's build one of these, just for fun. And actually there's no upgrades you can even do for it, so 190 gets you... Ah, this is a great I think this is the cruiser we're building for the rest of the game. <laughs> Are these Baltimores? They have good speed, they have good range, they have good... Uh, I would say damage, but hit points. I, I, I meant actually their damage, their 9, 8 inch guns. And what you can praise the most about them is their their anti-aircraft capabilities are really off the charts, for at least, at least for cruisers. Okay, so speed up. Now, I do want to capture these guys in the beginning of their mission. Maybe about halfway there, when they've all snuck together. That seems about right to me. By the way, did any of them launch without fuel? They all launched with fuel. That's good to see. Not sure where that other bug was coming from, frankly. So we'll break this group up into, I mean, we're going to break them up into a lot of groups, but let's see. One, so these two are, we'll leave those for last. Those will be the last group to divide. So we want two in here. We'll leave these two to be in here. We're going to want another two to go off and dive bomb somewhere else. And then we're going to want another two to go dive bomb off somewhere else. And now we'll start forming off the other groups. So, probably just do a bunch of groups of two. Okay, a group of three, I guess. And we have another group of three. Okay, fair enough. Okay, let's um, get everyone to move at the correct altitude now. It's the biggest thing left. Supposedly a fleet there. I think that's the PT boats. Not too worried about that. All right. So what? What do we want to do? I guess we'll be able to see the island even. Mainly we want to get a lot of altitude. Oh, good. We can actually see. Wow, this is great. So we have pretty good vision. How many of these are we facing? 
One 16 inch, go ahead, lower it. One, two, three. Am I seeing it correctly? Is that three? One, two, three. Not bad. Okay, three there. Lots of. Oh, we never even scouted this. That's right, the floating talk. Only three. Am I missing some? Is there like more over there? Oh, maybe. I can't tell, but there. I. Well, we'll have to keep scouting, right? Anyway, for now, what do we want to do? We want to give them an order, all of them an order. Instruction, yeah, they're coming from like this way. So we'll give them an order like this. Whoops, damn it. Guess we can just go at one X speed. Gonna hope that above 4,000 is enough. They hear us, they, or they see us coming. Probably hear, probably see, not hear. Not yet, at least. Ah, shoot. Okay. How are we doing on altitude? Good. I, I like we. She just. I feel like we can't <laughs> overdo it on the height. Like we just need to get enough altitude that we don't get shot down immediately. So we'll probably even goose this up a little bit more. Forty-two hundred or so. Yeah, I see that's that's right here. That's what we're looking at. These are necessary targets. Unfortunately, they're all the way on the other side. We'll save those for last. Actually, I mean, it's not really like you can really save something for last. We really have to go in all at once to try to get the most out of this little show. And the reason why I say that is if the guns are targeting someone, it means everyone else is temporarily free. And these are large AA emplacements. Just to point that out, that's why they look a little bit different. You can see that they're a little bit bigger. They have these four gun configurations. It's not what we're used to. So this is just the yeah, large AAA is it's gonna mow us down. I'm still hoping, however, against hope that 4,000 is high enough and I don't know, maybe we should be even more conservative. Why Why not, really? Let's, let's make the altitude even higher. Go up to 5,000, although this does mean, damn it. This does mean a longer dive time, a longer amount of exposure to AAA on the way down, but, ah, okay. So now we've scouted 91%. <laughs> We just go over to this. Where was it? This. I don't know how we suddenly. Oh, this. <laughs> the, the kingfisher is spotting for us. <laughs> Fair enough. Now, are there other things we're missing, though? I mean, if there's other little hidden. Contraptions. I mean, we do want to know about everything. So you guys are the lead. I actually want you guys to come in all together. This is pretty beautiful, though. This is pretty picturesque. 
And I, I think at 34, 35 minutes here, this will be the last action of our turn. I mean, our episode. Beautiful. It is beautiful. And this was a very, very well fortified island. For those of you who don't know, the truck... I mean, this was like the main operating point for, J for Japan. Just trying to give those guys a little bit of time to catch up. There we go. That's better. I think we'll leave it like that. I can hear him at least. Alright, so here we go in. <sighs> kind of approaching from the wrong direction. Is it worth my time to only approach from the south? Because this is... These are like defensive areas. We don't. Yeah, I guess it is worth my time. We're gonna maneuver everyone to the around the perimeter. So let's. Okay, let's do this. We move just to the left of that kingfisher. We'll go underneath the binoculars. So everyone does more or less the same thing. I think this is a wise idea. It's so cool watching them all move in. You have these guys up here. Yeah, so we'll send two. No, I think that these in the middle are the most important ones. We can get those probably in another mission. Also, the, from this vantage point, it's, first of all, again, it's really beautiful to be this high and like the kind of picturesque and all that, but from this vantage point we should be able to see if there's anything else we're missing. I would like to, I know it sounds funny, but I do want to destroy the hospital because I think that amphibious landings, uh, the barracks, I mean, well the hospital I think helps too. If It might help repair things faster. We obviously don't want things repairing faster when we have the first, first sag coming in. I feel like, I mean 91%, we're missing something somewhere. Is this, it can't be just this. That can't be 9%. Like it was like 87 or something, and then this changed it by quite a lot. Oh, wait. Oh my gosh, that is a lot of 16 inch guns. Okay, so we're, uh, change of plans really. We're gonna go for both. Okay, we're. I think we only need one per, and if that's the case, we. These are higher. These are just really high priority. We're gonna send one to each. In fact, we'll do this as an experiment. Who has the lowest on fuel? Is anybody down to half? No. This is the lowest person on fuel right here. So Charlie Squadron, we're gonna commandeer you. You guys are gonna make a run over to the far side of the island, um, where the PT boats are, I guess. And we're gonna see what happens when one of you guys dive bombs yeah, well I, I mean I, I think that 5500 might be a bit overkill whoa 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 that's fine okay now we want to circle back where are these guys Okay, so let's not give these guys the order to circle back yet. Okay, Charlie. We gotta do this. <laughs> it's too many. It's like herding cats. 
too much to do. I think this is perfect still. Okay, so let's break off. Let's get you to dive bomb this. And you to dive bomb this. I think it's one per, and we'll find this out in a moment. And I actually need to control them when they, when they, after they drop their bombs, I need to send them back either north or south so they don't, you know, just stupidly drive right through the, fly right through the huge anti-aircraft screen and get themselves killed. Alright, so now we'll send them back this way. Well, I guess we can send them north. Right under the binoculars again, I guess. Why not? Nope. Okay, good. So now back to Charlie. Let's watch the dive bomb go. They each have their targets. And we'll get them as a group to move once each of them has hopefully destroyed because this is good if they don't destroy it on their own this was definitely nice that we didn't have to worry about so we're gonna have to watch this guy in particular looks good looks very good perfect one does kill so move that direction Very nice. So all of Charlie moved this way. And when you guys... You move far enough south, we can send you back home. Okay, so we need one volunteer. Probably the lowest on fuel, but for me, I think it's just going to be this guy right here. You're going to break off. Form your own group. And your only mission is to destroy the last one here. We're in good shape. This is this is working out well. Combined, this is not combined um, combined arms in the terms of infantry and tanks, but this is combined air force and well, they're both naval. But <laughs> you get the point. Ships plus air. And then we have to just go in on that. And I guess for that, we actually want to, we want to do another, t uh, I think we want to move right up the binoculars again. And I'll probably send each group of two at a different target. That's my last dive bomber, so we actually want to click on him. Because once he's done, we need to give him the order to move all the way south before he does anything. South or north, but I'm just choosing south in this case, because I think the carrier fleet, actually, they're actually further north than they are south at this point, but everyone has half a tank of fuel, even after this little meandering we're doing. Should be just about dropping his bombs. Got it. All right, very good. Okay, so we have one, well, I should be able to count this here. One, two, three, four, five. We still have 10 aircraft left. We'll probably lose the first one to anti-aircraft. We only have three guns. One, two, three. Those are the only guns I can see that are left. Oh gosh, this it could work. <laughs> Alright, let's Yeah yeah, let's get you to move obviously way south. But let's get up to these group this group. Okay, yeah, and this group right here. Which one are you guys? Here. I want you to cut more towards everyone else. And then we'll make our run. All right, let's go ahead and do it. Okay, so first group is going to attack the first one. 
Uh, it'll just be random here. I'll send another one after you. Probably send one after this middle one. And the remainder will go for this last one. Wait. Four. Ah, there it is, five. So I'm gonna leave these, this group, whatever one this was. Okay, these guys are kind of the odd pair. I'm actually gonna do something different with them. I'm gonna pull them, uh, I wanna do actually altitude bombing with these. <laughs> so, well, I guess we will, we'll try it. Uh, they did not, they did not respond to their orders. Did they? Are they responding to their orders? They are, just kind of slowly. Okay, everyone is. Yeah, I think we can actually do this altitude bombing. It's very bizarre, but... In fact, we're almost right on. Let's try it. Okay. Um, you... Who do I have control of? You. So you actually pull back. Go this way. I'll control you in a moment. Give me half a second. Do, 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 do. Let's see if this works. Uh. All right, drop. <laughs> Just want to see if it'll work. <laughs> All right, who is supposed to be going after that leftmost one? Because we want to hold off on attacking it. That, this group. So we'll pull these guys back as well. Well, should we just have two each, send two after? I mean, why risk, I mean, okay, it's fine. We're going to go back and repair these at port anyway. So just do this. It was triple A. No, if you no idea if these guys will survive even. Now, who's the one who I? Yeah, you. You are going this way, and you are going to be my follow-up instrument. All right, let's note that the first unit of Baker Squad is my intended target. These guys have a long way to go. Oh my god, they're not going to make it. This is insane. God save you all. But they are definitely protecting the ones that come after. And it worked. It got two of them in the, in the end, actually. Wow. Wow. Perfect. Okay. So, you, your group, go this way. And somebody else was going after that. They should just... Oh! Iowa class battleships are now available! Amazing! Okay, and we scouted 98%. Still know, I still don't know what we're missing. Okay, wow. So we have the... So, yeah, we don't know what this is. <laughs> well, everyone here is dead anyway, right? Do we miss anything? I need to know, because we're pulling out now. Everyone's just pulling out. You guys can actually go home. I think you'll be... Nah, we'll just we'll send them this way. Still a little bit... Um, not quite directly back. You can come back this way. We don't need you. Oh, actually, no. Keep going this way, because... You'll be our, our scout to make sure we're not missing anything. And the rest of this group, I'll just individually, one at a time, I don't care. So these are all destroyed, right? Yeah. Lots of AAA. So let's get all these guys. Just head that way. I know that you're like in the middle of your dive and everything, but sorry. Just 
Go. Get out of here. Same with you. Who's this guy? Uh-oh. We, we missed one. Sacrificial lamb. And by the way, I sent one guy up. Is he maintaining altitude? Like, I would... You know what, buddy? I would climb if I were you. 7,000 might be a little insane, but... Yeah, we're losing a lot on the way out. Oh my god, we're losing a lot. I, I, you know what? Looking at the losses, I have no regrets <laughs> doing it the way we did, cheesing it a little bit. Okay, so he's directly over this. I don't just have him attack it. We don't need him. We can just have him drop down. Oh god, he's actually taking damage. Is he? No, he's not. There's another one taking damage. Get out! Okay, there it is. I think it's 100%. So, go ahead and keep moving. Get back up. Up in the air. Everyone here is... Yeah. Taking a nice... Okay, you guys are all tasked with going home now. Ah, okay, well, that was crazy. Okay, you can go home as well. So we'll just give the order for everyone to return to land. So I think there's a, a there is a button technically you can press right here, which but I have had some issues with it. If you're wondering why I'm doing this manually, as you can tell, what <laughs> I would not want to do this, but I don't want to do it. Like we'll try it with this one. Seems like it worked land. Okay, so let's see if that, is that, is anybody being stupid? Kingfisher's not, I'm not too concerned about the Kingfisher. Looks like we're going to be taking a big enough path out of here. That guy's way up in the air too. Alright, so everyone else will hopefully come back and, oh my gosh, what do you know? On the horizon is our battleship fleet. 52 minutes, my goodness. Well, this is what a dive bombing a successful dive bombing raid looks like. Note that we, we didn't have to do it this way, but I think that our results may not have been as good had we done it any other way. <laughs> we could see that the dive bombers probably would have gotten through. By the way, is this... thought that might have been a gun for a second. Yeah, it looks like we're okay. So, we'll be able to take out the rest, but it's been... Oh, what a long episode. So we'll call, the, call this video to a close here. Enjoy the long episode. Until the next video, thanks for watching, and take care.